What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to unroot a Galaxy S5. So Geohot's Tau root finally got this thing rooted at the press of a button, and the whole process behind that is so easy that many folks decided to finally give root a shot. Maybe you removed the bloatware that came pre-installed on your GS5, and that's all you wanted to do. Or maybe you need to return your device to the manufacturer. But whatever the reason, it's a pretty simple process to go about unrooting your phone. Now the first thing you should have done as soon as you rooted was to install a root management app. Chainfire's SuperSU is the main root management app today, so hopefully you installed it and used the setup process to update your super user binaries. But if you haven't done that, I'll walk you through the process because that's the tool that we'll be using to unroot. When you first launch SuperSU on a freshly rooted GS5, you'll be asked to update the super user binaries. Just hit continue here, then choose normal as the method of installation on this next menu. Afterwards, it'll ask if you want to disable Knox, but you should probably leave that one alone unless you don't care about your warranty, so hit Cancel. Then you should see a confirmation dialog that lets you know that the binaries were successfully installed and that a reboot is needed. So go ahead and reboot your phone at this point, and for the folks that have already installed SuperSU, the unrooting process starts when we get back up. Alright, so now that the reboot is out of the way, I'll go ahead and run Root Checker so that you can see that I'm currently rooted here. Now folks that followed my rooting guide should already be at this point in the process, so this is where the unrooting part begins. Just open up the SuperSU app on your phone, then hit cancel on this Knox message again. Next, head to the settings tab, then scroll down this list a little bit. Somewhere down here you should find an entry for full unroot. Go ahead and tap that, then hit continue on this next menu. Give it a few seconds here and the window should close out without any fanfare. At this point, you're already unrooted. You'll just need to reboot your phone for the changes to take effect. Okay, so here we are fresh off tapping the unroot button in SuperSU. Now if I run Root Checker again, you can see that I am no longer rooted. That's really all there is to it. Simple, right? But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article by heading to the link in the description. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, guys. But until then, happy gadget hacking!